Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to Sakura Swim Club. In the last episode, Hiromi had a grim look on her face for some reason, but then she just kind of sh shoved it aside. And then I went home and mother was trying to marry me off for some reason. Hmm, where am I now? Oh, we're in school. Before I knew it, several days passed by and it was time for swimming practice again. Several days? What well, happened in the time between that? The lessons barely sunk into my head. Oh. Hmm. Maybe that means you have a passion for swimming! The teacher's droning voice seemed far away and distant, almost like a dream. Well. Probably because you're daydreaming. I've been too busy being lost in my own thoughts. See? Told you. You really care about studying right now. No matter what they're teaching, all of the lessons seem exactly the same to me. I'm... Um, probably is. For whatever reason, I find myself thinking about what my second lesson with the swimming club will be like. I guess it's normal to be anxious. Hiromi made it quite clear that she and Miko are going to whip me into shape. Wait, wait, did, did, did I just say second? I thought the next day was the, the swimming practice. What? I'm confused. The only way I'm going to succeed at this is if it's by my own volition. That's right, no burdens, no weight on my shoulders. Whether or not I want to do it is the question. I just hope that it's not going to be like football all over again. Oh, what happened at football? I actually want to know now. Somehow, I don't think it will. It just feels different this time. Hmm, what happened at football? I arrive at the swimming pool, looking around to see if there's anyone else here. It doesn't look like it. I guess I'm the first one to turn up for practice. Or maybe they're still changing. I mean, all you have to do, Kata, is just put on swim trunks. Wait. No. I can hear someone in the changing room. Ah, see? Hiromi emerges. She seems mildly surprised. Wow. Hi. Hello there. Oh, Kata. You're here a lot earlier than I expected. What can I say? I'm keen for swimming. But something isn't right. I look around for a moment and realize what the problem is. Where's Miko? Oh. Yeah, where's Miko? She couldn't make it today. Oh, so are you teaching me today? She had something else she had to deal with. So I'll be training you today. Oh, hooray! She takes me through the basics again, insisting that I need to revise them in order to get better technique. Well, I mean, if Hiromi is better than Miko, then yep, of course. Just like Miko, she sends me off on laps. I do a little bit better than I did last time, but I'm still nowhere near their level. I mean, you're still a beginner. Exhausted. I barely managed to pull myself out of the water. I plop onto my back, trying to catch my breath back. As I sit back up, I see Hiromi wading through the pool towards me. Uh... Hi? She emerges from the water, her white hair flowing behind her. Wow, she's really beautiful. Small streams race across her skin, her soaked swimsuit clinging tightly to her body. She leans over the edge, her intense eyes focused on me. I know you can do better than that. As long as you keep trying, you will be as good as us one day. I wish. You two are amazing. I can barely keep up with either of you. Yeah. They're like speed bullets. Her cheeks go a bit red. Uh, thank you. 
He seems to be thinking about something. We're glad you joined. Things have been rough for us. What? Well, what do you mean? She looks a little bit sad as she says that. It would have been nice if we could get some more people to join. Don't worry about it. I'm sure things will go fine. We can have a club with just us three, right? You don't need that many people. Um, but how many people does it does a club need? Um, to stay a club. She ponders on it for a little bit. I guess not, but it never hurts to have more people. It's just been us two for a long time. Aww. Vacantly, she seems to drift off into her own thoughts. She shakes her head and comes back to Earth. Just remember that you won't get to be lazy with this club. There's only hard work ahead of you. All right. If you slack off, you'll regret it. Oh, that sounds scary. I look forward to it. Let's both work as hard as we can. That's another sentence that is said a lot. She looks more determined after I say that. For sure, I'm ready to train myself to exhaustion too. She seems re-energized now, ready to slip back into the water. Oh wow! Re-energized already? That was fast. If we do really well, we can enter the national tournament. Oh, whoa, whoa, hold on. National tournament? Only three of us? Imagine if we did that. We have a go to work towards then. Let's do it. I can see something twinkle in her eyes as I say that. Yay! She enthusiastically nods her head. I agree. Let's do it. We'll both make it to the swimming tournament. You mean, you mean us three? Or, or just us two? After a while, Miko appears. Wild Miko! Long after the lesson is done. Oh, swimming club is over. How did Keda do? He's getting better. We'll still have to see if he can become a swimmer. I appreciate the confidence boost. Whew. You're welcome. Swimming club's over for today though. Oh man, I want to do some more swimming. Hiromi heads over to the changing rooms. Keep it up, Keda. Don't worry, I will. She leaves Miko and I standing there. Hey, mind if we talk for a moment? Huh? Well, what do you want to talk about? Sure, what's the matter? I just wanted to say... We'll make you into a great swimmer. I'm sure of it. Aww. Thanks, Miko. Hmm. We'll see. I have no doubt. I have no doubt. Gotta increase your confidence. I have no doubt about that, since it'll be you teaching me. I really hope I can become as fast as you are one day. I... I'm nothing special. R really I'm not as good as you think I am. She holds her hands to her face, looking extremely embarrassed. S Stop embarrassing me. Why should you be embarrassed about being good? Yeah. I I don't know. It's it's just when you say it. Why would that be the case? I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you next time. She quickly bolts out of the door before I can say goodbye. <gasps> Is she slowly having a crush on me? Ooh. 
I don't really know what just happened there. More importantly, looking at her made me realize something. Am I no different when it comes to success? What do you mean? Or being good at something. Either way, swimming practice is over. Oh man. Time to head back home. Maybe I'll make it before dark this time. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Soccer Swim Club of of um, Hiromi. Just uh, giving us that confidence boost. So if you guys enjoyed it, then please slime the like button and help support me by sharing this video and by subscribing down below. Thank you everybody for watching this episode and you will hear me in the next one. Goodbye.